Hi, this is our Physics One project from um, Dr. Kevin Storr. My name is Henry Rivera. My name is Caleb Bartholomew. Hi, my name is Latha Bryan. My name is Arinze Collins to Rebelize. All right, in this project, our topic is gonna be about Einstein's general relativity theory. This theory is gonna explain uh, our pers perspective over the goalies perspective. So the kickers against the goalies perspective, pretty much. All right, we're gonna be using soccer to demonstrate this theory using projectile motion, centri centripetal acceleration, and the conservation of energy. All right, so in the first video, I'll explain about projectile, projectile motion and how different perspectives explain why the shot went in. Alright, so we're going to talk about the goalie's perspective, which was him. Yeah, um, from my perspective, I thought the ball was actually going out because the ball was really high. I thought it was going to go over the net, but apparently that was not the case. He actually went in and... The why it went All right, so we're going to talk about um, conservation of energy. So, so the moment the ball left my foot is when the kinetic energy started kicking in. So as uh, kinetic energy started going higher, the potential energy started decreasing. So as the ball kept going higher and higher, all the way till it reached the uh, maximum height, it actually ultra, it actually switched. So that was the potential energy, and there was no kinetic energy. But as soon as because of the gravity and it was going down. It alternated, saying uh, saying that there was more kinetic energy and zero potential energy. All right, and in, in the second part of the project, we're going to use centrifugal acceleration to determine the perspective of uh, the kicker and also the perspective of the goalie. Oh, oh! So, by doing this centrifugal acceleration uh, demonstration using the laws of physics and soccer, I'm going to give the I gave the ball an initial force with some type of frequency and period. And because of that, for, for my perspective, using the, the, the laws of aerodynamics and the laws of gravitational conservation of gravity, the ball looked like it was moving on its own using the centripetal acceleration force. So by, by, by giving it a curve, and, and as the ball rotates around, and die, the aerodynamics of it makes it turn to the right initially from the force I gave it to it. So thus, the ball going in after I, I gave it the, the initial force and the frequency. And my perspective, it was already going in, but the goalie perspective... This, from my perspective, whenever he shot the ball, the angle he took, it seemed like the ball was just going to keep going and then go to the left of the post. But what actually happened was because of the centripetal acceleration, it caused the ball to spin, and whenever it was spinning, it caused the ball to curve actually into the goal. Yeah. All right. Okay, so in conclusion, we have concluded that using University of Physics 1 projectile motion and conservation of energy and uh, centripetal acceleration, we stated and we, we found out that Einstein's general relativity theory was indeed actually correct because perspective is an, an actual physical property in this universe. My name is Letha Bryan. My name is Arinze Arubalese. My name is Henry Rivera. My name is Caleb Bartholomew. And deuces. Deuces! I see that? that was pretty good. Right now. How you doing? We gotta say our names, right? Or no? Um. My name is Lace. <laughs> My name is. Not now, man.